we have to um, now we have to kind of clean off the plastic gauge off the bearings and off the bearings on the caps and then we can start uh, installing this for real so okay Go ahead and before we do this, actually the next step, uh, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to go ahead and lube this up pretty good, get the crank crankshaft in, then uh, then clean the bear, then we're going to clean the bearings, put the bearings on top, uh, place them, get the uh, bolts lubed up again, and that's that, that. I think that's a pretty good procedure. So let's go ahead and do that. At this time, you want a good amount in here because uh, this is your protection. Um, this is just your protection uh, when you go to start up the car for the first time. We're gonna, I'm gonna end up uh, priming it, uh, but you know, this stuff's not that much. Uh, it's fourteen dollars a bottle, which seems like a lot, but it's just worth it just to put as much as you can on here. Really coat this because this is really important. Because then you got to tear it apart again, and that's talk about costing a lot of money. So, a lot of time and effort, and you know, time is money for sure. Okay, so let's make sure these are heavily coated. This does take a little, I'd have to admit that this, this part taking a while, cleaning each one. It's important though to take your time and uh, use the plastic gauge to uh, figure out, um, make sure your clearances are good. It's very important. So even though this takes time and then it takes time to clean it and a bit of a hassle, but it's important. And you know, uh, on any of these videos, if uh, you see, if you know, you've done this, you know, definitely, you know, if you've done this a lot of times or just more than once, good enough for me. <laughs> uh, you you know, feel free to give me some comments down below and uh, let me know what I'm doing wrong. Maybe and I'll, next time I rebuild an engine, I'll I'll learn something. So yeah, any, yeah. constructive criticism is always good. Okay, so, okay, um, I got the one cap in, but I figured 
seems like a better idea here is to uh, go ahead and get everything lubed up. Um, get all the bearings, get all the end caps on first, then go ahead and uh, then put your bolts in. So that's what we're doing. So that's what we're on. Otherwise, you're mixing your the the, the torque, uh, the uh, the lube for the bolts with the lube, and that's not good. So just one thing, do one thing at a time here. here okay okay we are done with that okay make sure these are set right and they are okay that's now now we're going to go ahead and put in the uh bolts. this on 30 I'm going to start here 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 and here and then the last one when we do the when we set the thrust bearing is uh, going to be by uh, prying it prying the crankshaft forward and then backward and then holding the pry there uh, the forward pressure up and then tighten it down hopefully I got that right. We'll see. Okay, so here we go. Let's do it in three steps this time. Okay, which two seem to be okay, but let's just do it. This is at 50. Step is uh, at seventy. Next step at seventy. Or actually, um, yeah, let's do seventy. Let's do sixty-five. I like sixty-five. Kind of in the middle. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, now, now, next step, it's kind of tricky for me the first time. I can get in there. I'm going to do this. Check. Okay. Um, now what does it say here? Check the inplay with a feeler gauge. The inplay should be correct if Okay. Um, I'm gonna put the real main seal in tomorrow. So we'll get to that. Uh, let's check the in play. I'll check in play tomorrow. It's kind of late right now. So let's just recheck this. Start here. One, two, on the next uh, video well you'll see on the one of the videos I post and I'll tell you which one it is of course uh, I had a I made a big mistake uh, first time I put these bearings in so you'll see what I you know try to figure out what I did so anyways that's done and this is you should be able to move it it shouldn't have any more like I said very little torque to move it around that's a whole idea anyways so we'll put in the seals tomorrow I'll check the I'm going to check the feeler gauges tomorrow and uh, I'll check the uh, I'll check the in play with the feeler gauges tomorrow. We'll, we'll, that's the first thing we'll do. So. Okay, well thank you for uh, staying with me and uh, being patient through my oddities in doing this. Uh, so, okay, uh, thank you very much and I'll see you tomorrow.